In this morning's health conversation, I sat down with Dr. Rupert Shaw of SSM Health to talk about a new hybrid diet that might be a fit for you. Take a look. When it comes to finding a healthy diet, there is a lot to be said for eating less meat and eating more vegetables. But if you're ready to commit to vegetarianism for any reason, then maybe the flexitarian diet might be the right one for you. SSM Health Family Medicine Physician and Wellness Coach Dr. Rupert Shaw joins me this morning to talk a little bit more about this. So first off, let's start with the basics. What exactly is flexitarianism? So it's a diet, um, as you would imagine, mm -hmm. where you can be flexible. So it combines the term flexible with vegetarianism. There we go. <laughs> so you're mostly eating plant forward, uh, lots of fruits and vegetables with the occasional animal products mixed in, but you're not committed to being any which so way. So maybe yep. like a gateway into it, <laughs> yeah. keeping your you know mm -hmm. normal diet just a little bit. Exactly. Um, is, this, is this a good diet for people to try out? Absolutely. It's sort of been ranked sort of um, high by the U.S. News and World Report, too, and for good reason, because it gives people options and flexibility, but being plant forward is is a healthier way to eat. You're mm -hmm. eating whole grains, fruits, vegetables, legumes, um, but then occasionally adding in the meat, um, eggs, and those types of things, which are a good source of protein as right. well. Right, need mm -hmm. the protein as well. Are there any risks of eating this way with this diet? Generally, I would say probably not, but just as with any diet, when you make kind of a dramatic change like that, it's always best to talk to your doctor. There is a risk if you're too strict in cutting out certain products um, that you could uh, develop some vitamin deficiencies such as B12, zinc, calcium. These things would be rare in a diet such as flexitarianism because, again, it's flexible, and so you <laughs> have the capability to add those foods in when you need them. Yeah, you kind of need to find yeah. the balance that works for exactly. you. Exactly. So how can this diet be beneficial for people? So anytime we're eating more plant forward, more fruits, more vegetables. We are reducing our risk for heart disease. We're reducing our carbon footprint. Um, so a lot of great health benefits, especially if you have uh, heart disease, uh, diabetes, and it may even help some people lose weight or maintain their weight a bit better. A lot of good information yeah. there. Dr. Shaw, where else can people find you? So they can find me on Instagram at wellness with Dr. Shaw. All right, be sure to check it out. Thank you. Okay, thank you.